Yo! Video games. Someone knows this back. Someone will remember. Round Fight. Intel 12 Gen CPU is to be found in Creator PC series. That's a I bought that. Ah, okay. Well, I don't know if we played 12 Gen. Like, when he was building it, maybe was out then? He got it after I did, so yeah. Oh, okay. I don't even think 12th gen is the latest anymore. 13th. Or, yeah, 13th gen, I think, now. Of course they are. And by the time you get the 13th gen, I mean, it's like it's yeah. yearly. Mm. 12th gen will change your life, though. Until 14th gen comes out, then I'll change your life. Well, I mean, the fact is the 12th gen can stream and game at the same time. Yeah. And yeah, but still, it's, I'd rather have a different PC, like, to, to, to do the gaming on. No, you yeah. don't need to. That's why 12th gen is so beautiful. Mm. You don't, that is a, that is a bitch. To, I'm to, doing better, Sochino. Thank you, man. It is a huge bitch to try to capture off of one PC onto another. It's just, it, is, it is a bitch, and it's annoying, and, it is. and you don't have to do it. I do it. Yeah, it's an HDMI. You do it, but was it, was it easy and fun to set up? No. Not fun and easy. No. <laughs> I, it, it, for me, it's the same thing as uh, streaming off of my, um, my console. No, it's not. Mm. Shit is way more prone to go wrong. Mm. Like, suddenly audio drivers are gone, and you have to yeah. update them, and like, they won't. That's just PC problems in general, man. Well, you, want, you, like, you don't have to do that if you're streaming yeah, all right, the, the same thing. Yeah, yeah. Down for it. Oh my god, because right. I did that. I did that for a little bit with, with uh, I had a gaming laptop to stream, and then I had the, the PC to play the game on. The PC was a little bit better. Yeah. But Jesus Christ, like... It was working fine, and now, now I cannot capture audio off the PC. Why can't I capture audio? Debunked a million different things. It was probably a driver issue or something. Hey, you know what's funny? You, you, you don't want to do it, but you end up spending like all day just trying to figure out one small right. problem. Like, it, uh, yes. I fucking hated it. So you understand, dude? I've been fucking with uh, computers since like Windows 95. Like that shit has always been an issue. There's always something going wrong. And if you're like Max, who enjoys the the um, the process of figuring things out and then you know solving it afterwards. Then the PCs are for you. For the for the person that is fucking over it and just wants it to fucking work, you're like that's me. I just I'm tired. I hate it. Wow. Damn, I'm stuffing. I was a stove top stuffing. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Whoa, what the hell is that? You're not commenting. You don't have to. You don't have to build your own PC. There's plenty of easy ways to just buy pre-built PCs that are good. Like, it did end up being expensive, though. That's yeah. The but, I mean, they look, And you know what's funny? As an average consumer, damn. I see how they get ripped off because I went over to fucking Best Buy and all they had were the shittiest fucking uh, computers yeah. for way more oh, yeah. than yeah. what they're fucking worth. Well, you're talking retail markup. Well, uh, that's what I'm saying is that the average consumer doesn't understand that, hey, look, don't go there. there. And then there's like buying expensive HDMI cables. There's an average consumer yeah. that's like, I don't fucking care. Yeah. I just want, I just want to walk into a store and walk home with the thing that works. Like they don't want to sit there and they don't want to browse and then like do do taxes to yeah. decide which PC to get yeah, or yeah. build it online. They just want to like that Fucking one yeah. and then <laughs> and, and, they, and, they, and they wonder why it breaks down in like three years or some shit. Of course, yeah. yeah. So it's like fuck. Let's go buy another one. Steve, did you get a Steam Deck yet? Uh, I don't think I'll ever get a Steam Deck. I don't, All right. I don't know if that's something yeah. I'm really... I want that um, that uh, emulation little system. Emulation little system? Yeah, there's, well, there's a bunch of those now. What do you mean? There's a bunch of these, like, Chinese... Um, what? They look like... They kind of look like a Switch or, like, even less, but they look smaller. They're little, they're little emulation boxes. They're little handheld gaming systems. Oh, okay. Like a GGHV. And they, they play... Are they legal? Yes. Well, the system, sure. Emul yeah. Emulation is legal. It's funny how I always get people like, emulation is not legal. Yes, it fucking is. Um, <laughs> Pleb. It's the games, though. It's the games. Right, yeah, right. Yeah, it's, and, it's and, and the games. bonds are not technically illegal as long as you own the, the original copy. Physical, yeah, yeah. physical copy. Yeah. It's like you made your own backup, whatever. Um, 
See, the question is, is are they going to come to your house and be like, okay, let me see your original copy, and then you have to show a receipt that says, yes, you bought I mean, the game. And then there's shit like fucking Maine, right, which does all the old arcades. Yeah, yeah. And then there's like, most of these companies are out of fucking business. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. And it's yeah. like, part of me is kind of like, yeah, and, and this media would be lost for fucking ever if it wasn't for people well, making, even Spencer making like that. bombs of them. That's true. So, I don't know, like... The companies themselves do not give a shit about the product after Fucking hell, bro. Yeah. Nice so. thing back. It was, was like, was like okay, yes, I have Xenoblade 3 on my okay, no perfect. Perfect. Was that, That's brand new. What was that weird shit years ago about the Atari and um, E.T.? Remember that E.T. scandal? It wasn't a scandal. It's not a scandal, it's buried. Yeah, like, and then somebody like found it and it was like, it was oh, a land from it was, Mexico. It was a relic. Like, oh my god, you found the only copy of fucking E.T. It wasn't the only copy. It was the, the I think you miss, miss the story here. It's like, mm. people thought that the landfill story was a myth. Yeah. Like, there was debate for years on whether or not that was the story of Atari dumped thousands of these in a landfill and crushed them. Yeah. If that was true or not. It was true. Yeah. All right. there, were, there, were, dug them up. there are a million billion copies of the game floating around out there. The the, the story was whether or not they ever actually offloaded them. Yeah, was that bullshit? You yeah. Know, uh, was it bullshit that there's some there's random dirt hole in New Mexico with a billion copies of E.T. below it under the earth? Yeah. Turns out, yes. Uh, it was actually true. They went there and they dug the shit up and there was... Bunch of old ass fucking ET cartridges in that, then they all went home after that. Yeah, it was over. It was like, everybody, oh. everybody just went home. It was like, yeah, that thing was true. All right, see you later. All right, bye. Go to the beach stage, Kenny. Hey, all right. Hey. Go down to the beach why stage. Why do you guys bye. not bye. want to go to the beach every time? What is yeah, wrong with you? Yeah, Kenny, it stage. protest. That's my picture. You got time. Yeah, those, little, PC, those are old fast. I don't have a lot of time to process. I forget the copy. Yeah, those little emulation systems are pretty cool. But yeah. it's like, yeah, like, I emulate stuff, again, like on my Switch. It's brand new, right? Yeah. Games came out. I own three fucking copies of some of the games that oh, yeah. I'm emulating. It wasn't just E.T., it was a tons of overstock. It was, it was a bunch of over, overstock, overstock uh, Atari 2600 product from the crash. I always hated the idea of that. Oh, well, we can't sell it anymore because no one's buying it, so let's just dump it somewhere. It's like, bro, you, you can't well, just give that away. You couldn't give it away to some kid nah. who like, needed it. Bury it. Like, what no child really needs this. There's stories of kids <laughs> rejecting it. When well, E.T. was like the worst game of all time or some shit like that, or yeah, something crazy like it's that. It's bad. Bro. Great Typhoon, thank you. It's also like a game that was made in like two months. Yeah. Wow, what the well, fuck, Well, it was super bro. fast to make games in that, those times, anyway. Like, but not that fast. Okay. Yeah, I know, not, no, obviously not that fast, but yeah. Hey, one guy. Yeah. One guy made it in a couple months. Yeah. You couldn't pay people to play that game. That's pretty bad. <laughs> yes, E.T. actually killed the video game industry. After that, the video game industry just died. Yes, and it but never it, came it, back. it's not exactly... E.T. wasn't the one thing that did it where people like, oh my god, this one video game is so bad, I'm never playing any video game ever again. <laughs> no. There was a lot of shovelware. Like, the market was flooded with crap, and no one cared anymore. Atari 2600 had been out for a long, long fucking time. The great gaming crash. 1983. Mm. And that was between Atari and Super Nintendo, or just regular Nintendo, sorry. No, Nintendo didn't exist. No, that's what I'm saying. It was like the era between yeah. uh, Atari and Nintendo. Yeah, 83 to 85. Nintendo kind of revived everything once it came out and kind of started dominating shit. E.T. was the last draw. Yeah, shit. Superman 64 was worse. I mean, they're all fucking punished. Neither one are fun to play, so mm. who cares? Yeah. Well, I keep telling you, Simmons, the uh, a fucking oh, fucking punish uh, a sandbox like uh, Superman would be fucking amazing. Oh, it wouldn't. Yeah. And I keep telling you, you give you give an open world Superman game. Open world, yeah. All his powers unrestricted. It's not going to be fun beyond an hour. Oh, just have better better enemies. That's all. <laughs> so what? Then you're yeah. just going to get any other fighting game, action game. With down, the backdrop is a bunch of buildings falling down around you. Oh, yeah. but you get the fucking enemies doing crazy shit, and now Superman's doing crazy shit, and now it's a fucking open world of oh, everybody doing crazy shit. It's fucking awesome. It's just it, like it, Spider Man. It'll, it'll be fun for about an hour. That's like saying Spider Man. And then all the buildings will be destroyed. Remember, as I say, 
unrestricted. Superman with all his powers. Like the Superman that can lift a fucking continent. Ow! Yay! You think Ow! Of uh, like pre, like golden era Superman, where he's like, yeah, he's, you give, he's, you give he sneezes and destroys the universe. Right. You, That's you, unrestricted. Nah, we don't do that. Superman with, with, Unli with all his abilities, no do restrictions. That. We don't do that. It's it's gonna be boring after a little after about an hour or so. Oh, Saints Row. Saints Row Four did it, yeah, but it, like you you leveled up and got powers, but yeah, it had the same problem. Like no one ever did anything in the city. They just flew from objective to objective. Just fly over, punch shit, fly over, punch shit. Yeah, we're speaking of powers, I don't think that would be a bad thing either. Because I think you could absolutely make a really interesting Superman game. Yeah. If, But if you're just thinking, oh, open world, him just flying around, flying through buildings at, like, lightning speed, like, it's just... Fuck it, give it to me. I'm obliterating fuck. shit. And I'm like, well, that'll be fun for about an hour, and then you're going to be like, all right, well, I've leveled the whole fucking continent at this point. Yeah, people love What's there that? left to do? Right. People love that uh, fucking Monsters game where you just go around the building smashing shit. What is that fucking old ass arcade game? Rampage? Rampage. Yeah, hey, know how fun Rampage is? People love the shit out of that game. Maybe, maybe 15, 30 minutes, then Rampage gets uh, old. It was crazy. Real quick. It was crazy <laughs> successful and even got a movie with The Rock. It was an arcade game. With yeah. The Rock. With The yeah, Rock. It's, it's an arcade game. Dwayne Johnson. Dwayne The Rock Johnson. Shazam! I saw that movie. Yeah, that? I did too. I did too. Not bad. It was. It was okay. It was alright. It was uh. It was fine. Not Negan. It was fine. Really it wasn't. It, it was about. It what was I, what you expected. It's about what I expected. It was literally what you expected. There's nothing outside of that. But yeah, like you play that game, we we can turn it on right now on one of these systems, Steven. You will be bored before 15 minutes is up. Well, of course, yeah, but I'm just I'm saying. Like most start, it's, it's I'm saying. I'm it's saying. Fun, but Super, like it doesn't have. Like, Superman is more in depth than what you're actually getting credit for. You I could think, make it that, but if you give him unrestricted powers, he's it's not going to be that. Fun I'd say probably towards the end, he has all his restricted powers. You 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 have a Superman scenario where. Uh, the, he's he's dealing with a red sun, and he's right. So then, then you're immediately limiting it. So right. It's like, so okay, then he so, builds, so it's a build up. So he builds up his powers towards right. the end of the fucking game, and then he has all his powers at the end. Regardless whether he has all his powers or he builds up his powers, whoa. Um, he, he would still be a character. Fucking Steve, you change your buttons, but I still won. Whoa. I was you supposed to do my super. That? Yeah, I, I don't do my supers. Bro, you've been playing for how long? I don't do supers. <laughs> Unless I need to. I think there's also just a lot more interesting ways to make a Superman game. Sure. Than, than just... Sandbox or... Yeah, uh, then you just like, I can just fly around and blow shit up with my mind. Like, but my that's eyes. that's the that's the thing that people always wanted, is to be able to fly through a city. Like, that's the whole point of Superman, is like, okay, we want that unrestricted freedom of Superman. Uh -huh. This is why N64 or Superman 64 was him yeah. flying around. Well, I mean, it was a shitty game on a shitty engine made by a shitty, shitty developer, game, yeah. so it's like... Well, yeah, sure, whatever, but... And you know, their excuse was we didn't have enough time. They, uh, That's literally what their excuse there's was. A, that and WB kept making weird requests. Quest, yeah, them. at the time. It was a, it was a shitstorm. It was a shitstorm. Oh, yeah, totally, but... Uh, and, and It would be fun for an hour. I don't know how you make a full game out of unrestricted powers of Superman. Prototype is the best Superman game? Uh, I've never actually played Prototype. Okay. Yeah, the thing. Yeah, I know, I know. I just never played it. I, I actually enjoyed, um, God, what was it? Infamous. Infamous yeah, was yeah, fine. Prototype was. It was budget Infamous. Yeah, Infamous was great. I never played Second Son, and I still want to, but from what I've heard, Second Son isn't as good. I don't know. I don't care anymore, because they made Ghost of Tsushima, and that's my new love now. There you go. With, with uh, Sucker Punch. Matrix open world win. Well, you guys were, were fucking losing your shit. Yeah, over that. Matrix Online. You guys are losing your shit over that that um, that tech copy or that, that um, uh, tech demo. Sorry, not copy. That tech demo. That uh, I don't Matrix thing. Shit. You didn't like it? I just, I didn't think it was that impressive. I thought it was good, but you guys were like, oh my god, this is made fucking oh my god. And I've been playing fucking GTA forever, and I was literally seeing the same shit. So I was like, oh, okay. <laughs> no, no, you haven't. Yeah, I can understand the whole concept of okay. All of the cars that are in one area are still there. Like, it actually still remembers where that shit is. Even if you go to an area way over there. There's definitely... In GTA, they just spawn it there, near you. There's definitely things in that game that, that 
doing. Nobody is doing. Nobody is doing. Yeah, I totally get it. It's it's revolutionizing a bunch of shit. Nobody's actually really um, uh, utilized that yet, though. Of course not, because it's fucking expensive. A little bit. It requires a shit ton of manpower. A little bit. And no one wants to make the next cyberpunk disaster. Yeah, that was, that was something else. Oh, damn. And I don't blame them. Prototype was a Venom game. Oh, Venom the character? Yeah, you could look at it and... Like, no, it was Venom it. Open World. Venom, 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 Venom. You said, fuck your moves. So what the hell's mine? Yeah, yeah, everybody has an armor move, but I forget which one they have. everyone has. I know it's far away. The next year or two is gonna be huge for Unreal Five. I know, I know it's far away, but goddamn it, I really want, I really want to see Ghost of Tsushima too. Damn it! I still haven't beat the, the DLC, so I. Of course gotta, you haven't. Yeah, I know. I gotta get on that. It's not even that long. My chat is demanding. I, I beat other shit. They're yelling at me. Don't listen to them. They're yelling at me though. <laughs> I mean, it's not like it really adds a shit ton of, like, story or anything. Yeah, I know. Well, none in the corner again. Chat, is Unreal the, the, the ultimate engine to use? Is it, yes. is it the best engine? Yes. I, I, think, I think the RE engine is better. It's pretty mm -hmm. amazing. Wow. The problem is, is, A, it's not as, probably not I as played personal, Vanquish. I did. But, more to the point, everyone around the world knows how to, how, how to work on Unreal. Unreal. So they can make it good. They can make it, yeah, exactly. That's the biggest problem. Mm. Is that, like... Unreal is overrated? Mm. Two fucking development... He said it's overrated. Two fucking development teams within one studio know how to work on RE Engine. It is the most common. It's the... It's the pro tools of, right. of, of, of fucking uh, video gaming. I mean, Unreal 5 is cool. It's not bad. It definitely does wow, some shit. Wow, so. I wish Id Tech 7 would take off. Fuck, no, no, we got Unreal. Man. <laughs> yeah, it's the art that's true. It's the art that's, that, that makes Unreal. The, the people that make the art on Unreal is what makes them really so fucking amazing. Oh, engines, people have, get this weird thing in their like, engines to determine art style, and they don't. They don't. Yeah. I think, I, I think, um, uh, it's a bad match, uh, fucking Eddie's a bad matchup for fucking, um, uh, It's definitely a bad matchup, because I don't know what it does. Ah, uh, well, I mean, you know. Nobody plays Eddie online. Those kicks are gonna be all over the fucking place. Microsoft is getting pushback on the Activision buyout. Yeah, Sony's lobbying hard against it. They're whining bitches. Ha! <laughs> While they buy out. Uh, yeah, you don't want to just buy out that shit. Like, what the fuck? I mean, it makes sense to, to say, hey, call them out on that shit. Nobody wants a fucking Monopoly, my sins. It's not a Monopoly, no. Activision makes one fucking game with Call of Duty. <laughs> of course, there's the Blizzard aspect of it, too, but. Yeah, it's Activision Blizzard. Not but even then, like, Blizzard makes, like, what? Two, two games? Yeah, I was just about to say that. They, they make that one anti game, Overwatch? <laughs> Dude, Overwatch 2 has been out for how long and I still haven't played it. They did this whole Halloween thing and I haven't even touched the fucking game. That's shameful. Like, I want to actually play the Halloween thing just a little bit. And like, fuck. You know what? We haven't played and, and it came out and none of us fucking touched except for me because I'm fucking awesome. Uh, the uh, Ghostbusters game. I want to play it. Come on, you know you guys. We, 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 we were waiting I played for you. It on, I literally played it on stream. We were waiting for you. Fucking to played get it on better? stream. Nobody we were, fucking touched the game. Because you guys uh, never touched the game. I can't. We were waiting it. for you, Steve. Uh, so we, we can. You know what you guys played when it first came out? Aliens. You guys played that immediately when it first came out. But fucking. Well, it, yeah. Ghostbusters came out. Nothing. Crickets. We were waiting for you. Yeah. Is that what you guys are doing? Yeah. Yes. I mean, I bet you Max doesn't even have it downloaded on his fucking thing. I bet he doesn't even have it. I do not have it. Bam. I don't have it. There you go. I got like six out of ten, so I was kind of like, oh, okay. Wow. I mean, Aliens is better than Ghostbusters. You listen to reviews, Max? Is that what you're doing now? Well, is that where we come to? I mean, they usually have a uh, yeah reviews that we're doing. Concerning information. Yeah, reviews that we're doing. Just saying, Aliens is cooler than Ghostbusters. Ooh. What? Tell me I'm wrong. <laughs> yeah, no, 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 he did nothing. <laughs> Aliens is a better movie than Ghostbusters. <laughs> That's not debatable, Steve. Uh, 
It's not. Chat? Oh, no. What, 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 what do we say here? What do we say Put here? Put him in the oh, foot. No. Where are we going with this? Where are we going with this? <laughs> tomato tomorrow? <laughs> it is a little tomato tomorrow, but it is a better film. Mm -hmm. Oof. Oh, what the fuck? They're both great sloppy toppy blowjobs. How about that? <laughs> wow. <laughs> Holy fuck, man. <laughs> Oh god. One of them's an apple blowjob, the other one's an orange. Jesus. Both sloppy toppies. Oranges have more acid, so you know, you know I'll do that. Yeah, I guess it depends on the person. That's true. I'm not gonna say I'm not saying either are bad. I'm just, yeah, 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 he's saying one's better than the other. I'm saying yeah, this is a better film. And he's also saying you're wrong, chat. I need grapefruit. <laughs> I don't want no apples, I don't want no oranges, I want grapefruit. That's happened again! Yeah! Yeah! Oh, good shit. There you go. That was good. Did you change anything, Kenny? Or nope. Your okay. buttons. I don't know what super is. What the fuck is simple? Stuff? I have no idea. Oh, interesting. Max yeah, agrees with me. Well, because he's just fucking <laughs> Yeah, I mean, it's boy. close, he's right? He's an alien fanboy. That's, that's, that's a close one. Guy. And if we're talking like it's like a it's like 100% compared to 99.5. <laughs> and aliens just makes for cooler video gaming than Ghostbusters. I don't, know, man. I don't know about that. Uh, I mean, I, I mean, the Ghostbusters game is pretty cool, dude. Like, like four of us, Mark all of us Ghostbusters, and the stinky, is it three players, the stinky horny four players. Uh, four so, player is the ghost. Max, go. Mark or Law? No, I don't care. The no, fifth player is five player players. players. It's all it's of us. One of those asymmetric. Chat, Mark or Law? Law. Don't be using your stinky dank Marduk. I'm about to use my Marduk against you. Hey, fuck no. I yeah, pick Marduk, I'll figure out what to do with him. Damn. Oh shit. He's going to reach. Can't get knowledge checked. You hipster uh, bartender, Marduk. Yeah, I pick. Did I not pick? Even Ricky Moe says Marduk is a problem. Who the fuck is Ricky Moe? Hey, Morris. Oh. And it's, everything he says is law. Kevin okay, Kleinman. Oh man, this song. Is anyone else sick of like every fucking like horror franchise becoming like a five asymmetric. asymmetrical multiplayer? Yeah, a little like bit. Everything, phantasm, like everything all... becoming dead by daylight. Any, any, ah. Like anything horror. Yeah, anything by any horror or like close to horror now has to be. It has to be a five-player asymmetrical horror game. One person is the bad guy, the other four are trying to escape or kill him. Every single one, every single thing. Here, okay, uh, Joy loves. Um... What's it called? Uh, that Goku or that fucking Dragon Ball one, which is literally- Dragon Ball fucking Dragon did it Ball has too. it, yep. Jesus Christ! Dragon Ball has it. The only thing notable there is it lets you play with Farmer with a shotgun. Yeah, absolutely. What's the reference there? No. Farmer with a shotgun. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> all right, yeah. then. All right, then. Uh, although, I'll be, I'll be honest, I think Rift Nuts is right. Like, we need a thing version. Some... Shut up! No! No more! No, no. more! You no more! You shut your whore mouth! No more! Let me, let me change my... No more! You see this painting, chat? You see this painting with tomatoes on it? You know what's more offensive? That Simmons doesn't think the thing which could be done very well if there was a fucking super Get amazing... Him, Get him. Yeah, a super... Um, it's Among Us, but it'd be better than Among Us. You know what I'm saying? It could be better, but we just need the right... Developer, do you see this paint? You see this? You think this is offensive? Me putting tomato juice, uh, t tomato soup on it? Simmons is thinking. How about we just make a really fucking creepy as fuck, like, you know, single player game? Look at the dance. There, is, a, there was one. The, but nah, there was one on, on PS2. PS2. On the PS2. On the PS2. And it was solid. Look at the damage. And you know what? You know what's, more, you know what's more offensive? Look at the damage. That was 20 years ago. You know what's more Look offensive? It. That people don't get to play, that, people don't see how good that game was. Because it was a PS2 game. It was good. It was like 20 years ago. Yes. Make it with current day, you know, technology and graphics. Exactly. It'll be fucking great. I want to be scary and shit. Oh my god, that, that you're plus 9,000 on that <laughs> shit. Plus 9,000. <laughs> Yeah, I'm even watching, I've been watching a lot of Tekken streams, and even the people that stream the fuck out of Tekken are like, Marduk's cheap as fuck. <laughs> <laughs> That's what Mickey Mouse says! I don't want to hear it, I don't want to hear it. Shut up, that's the new player. That's the new player. Bullshit. Steve always plays top tiers! Yeah. But for, I'll, give the, I'll give this to Steve, he's played Marduk for a fucking long time. Thank you. That's what I will give to Steve. And Steve hit the lotto when it came out. Oh, the lotto! 
<laughs> this character has problems. Come on, yeah, y'all need go. to stop. I gave it to Steven. Y'all need back. to stop. You know what has problems? The planet Earth has oh, problems. God. You think this tomato sauce on this painting has problems? Steve downplaying Marta. That's a problem. Jesus. As well as the destruction of the rainforest. Two major problems right here, chat. The destruction of the rainforest and Steve's fucking downplaying of Marta. I'm gonna put tomato juice on Steve. Oh my god, it's low and high. Or low and mid. <laughs> it was worth going back to get this shirt, chat. It was worth it. Wow, low profile, it's okay. Okay. Boink. Cause Steve, can you explain to me why Tekken had like a why Tekken kind of went down in popularity after five? After five? Because six. Because uh, here's six. Because six was not great. Right. Because so you had, uh, had Tekken three, which is when it really blew up. Like it was yeah. popular, but it blew up on three, right? Mm -hmm. Tekken tag huge because launch phase two. Four people were mixed on four, right? Five comes along, everyone loves five. Five's fucking great, right? And people love five. They love Dark Resurrection. Six and Tag 2 was like this sort of like... Six, Tag 2, and Cross Tekken, or Street Fighter Cross Tekken. It was like this weird period where it felt like Tekken was kind of like winding down almost, you know? Like, uh, I'll tell you right now. Um, it was... Uh, God, what's it called? What was it about it, Six it was, and Tag it 2 was that Revolution, people like? It was Revolution and Online. Those are the two I, I think really people like Tekken Tag 2 better than Six. I think Tag 2 is more, is more loved than 6. 6, mm. people just don't like it. Like, 6 and 4 are the bastards of, uh, of Tekken. Right. People are like, yo, I'd rather play Tag 2 than 6. Am I, am I wrong? I mean, I, I'm not, I'm like, literally, I, this is not about, like, what do you personally feel? It's not about that. I'm saying, like, the sales, the numbers don't lie. Like, Tekken was on a downward trend after 5. Like, Six didn't sell as much as five. Tag two. Right, yeah, hang on, we like tag two. Twenty five gifts up. Thank you, shit. Oh, the weeb. But in, well, here's the thing too. You know what? Like Tekken six started overcomplicating things a little bit, and so did Tekken two. Uh, Tekken two was kind of like overcomplicating stuff, and Tekken six started like with the whole balance. It was just getting weird and shit like that, and people didn't like it. But I think of the overcomplicating, Tekken two was a bit more fun. Came out after Tekken 5. Yeah, Bounding six. was busted in 6. It was just kind of... Bounding? Yeah. Okay, I hate that word. Yeah, well, they hated that word and hated that fucking... Mechanic. The numbers Mechanic. don't lie. You can look it up. Like, Namco literally said Tag 2 underperformed sales. Tekken Tag 2. And, you know, that was after 6. Marketing for Tekken Tag 2 wasn't great either. Are you kidding me? Did you Whoa. not listen to the Snoop Dogg right? song? Did you not listen to the Snoop Dogg song and see that trailer? Look at Tekken Tag 2's trailer right now. My head cannon, fucking look up the news. Look it up. They literally fucking said that Tag 2 was under underperformed. Did not sell it. Here's the problem, Sam. Here's the problem. I don't think they're going to look it up. They're not going to look it up. They're not going to look it up. Of course well, not. When you go to certain rallies and tell people to look up facts, they don't want to look it up. They're not going to look it up. They're not going to look it up. <laughs> they're going to look it up. <laughs> I'm pretty sure he's not going to look it up. Yeah. Well, you know what you can look up? The Tekken Tag 2 trailer with Snoop Dogg, because that's fire. <laughs> you know what else is on fire? The rainforest. <laughs> the rainforest. The rainforest is on fire.